The ANC has kicked out its youth league leader for five years and the four victims of a devastating fire in the Little Karoo will be buried on Saturday. Ambusasewa Khatebe with the latest news update. The ANC has kicked out its youth league leader Julius Malema for five years after finding him guilty of sowing division in the party and bringing the party into disrepute. Malema, who has been pushing for nationalization of the mines, is expected to appeal against the sentence, which is harsher than analysts had expected. The ANC chairperson of the National Disciplinary Committee, Derek Hanekom. Firstly, with regard to the respondent's disciplinary hearing in May 2010, the respondent's membership is suspended for a period of two years. In respect of the present disciplinary hearing, the respondent's membership is suspended for a period of five years. This ruling is applicable to the respondent's membership of the ANC Youth League and the respondent shall vacate his position as president of the ANC Youth League. League supporters in Bolukwane have expressed their loyalty to Malema following his suspension from the ANC and removal from the league leadership. Some of the supporters have been camping outside the local UNISA campus where he was writing exams. SABC reporter Jabulani Baloy. The ANC youth league supporters have partially blockaded the London Marais Strait just outside the campus in Bolukwane. There are singing songs saying they are behind Julius Malema. Traffic flow has been slightly affected. Meanwhile, a small group of police officers are watching the situation. Jablani Valoi, SABC News, Bolokwane. For the background in Malema's disciplinary hearing, go to option 7. The ratings agency Moody's says it will put South Africa's top five banks under review for a possible downgrade, citing the growing difficulty governments are facing in supporting their banks. The review will target Standard Bank, First Rand Limited, APSA Group, NetBank Limited and Investec. It also reflects the recent negative outlook on South Africa's bond rating. Yesterday, the credit rater downgraded the outlook for South Africa's A3 bond rating from stable to negative, given constraint public finances and signs that government's financial flexibility may be weakening. And lastly, the four victims of a devastating fire in Urtrun in the Little Karoo will be buried on Saturday. Seven people, including three children, died when a fire gutted a wood and iron structure in Bongoletu last weekend. The Urtswan Municipal Spokesperson Ntobego Mangwengwe says a memorial service will be held tomorrow. Funeral arrangements are underway as the municipal delegation met with families for finalization of arrangements. Um, indications are that the mass funeral will be held for four of the seven deceased. And then for the remaining three, the um, uh, funeral arrangement will be private. And, and that it will be conducted by the New Apostolic Church. Catch the latest news anytime here on Newsbreak Option 1.